Hi everybody, it's Miss Barry. Today we're going to learn about two young athletes to go along with our lesson. Venus and Serena Williams. This book is called Sisters. Do you have any siblings? That's one of going to be one of our questions. Okay, I'm going to read the book and then I'll show you the pictures as we go along. Sisters. Venus reads to her little sister, Serena. As night slips down over the bed they share in their house in Compton, California. So there's Venus and Serena, and there's the bed that they share. Do you share a room with your sibling? Outside, in the darkness, life goes on till early dawn. When the sun rises up over the sister's sleepy bed, Daddy and Mama want their two youngest girls to learn tennis. They have dreams for the future. Daddy and Mama learn how to play tennis so they can teach Venus and Serena how to play. So there's the tennis court outside their house. And then there's their house. Early morning, Daddy takes the sisters to the court where some older boys think it's still night. Daddy tells the boys his girls need to practice their tennis. Scowl meets scowl. So there's the older boys, and there's the girls, Venus and Serena. Does the tennis court look clean or does it look dirty? It looks a little dirty to me. I wonder what they're gonna do. The morning cleanup happens again and again, and then practice. With used up balls, not much bounce, and used up rackets, not much spring. I didn't grow up playing at the country cl club, Serena says. So there they are, they're cleaning the court with their dad, there's their dad, and then they're there, getting ready to clean up. Serve, return, volley. Forehand, backhand. Over and over. Concentrate, says Daddy. There they are practicing. There's their old rackets. They're using some old balls, but they're still practicing. They're still making it work. Back and forth, back and forth. Two little sisters learning the game. Venus and Serena concentrate hard, trying not to hear the gunfire down the street. Like a, in a cocoon, the sisters focus on the ball. There they are practicing. So there's Venus, there's Serena, and they're practicing their tennis. The boys start hanging around and watching. The sisters have their first attention and respect. Venus and Serena hit the ball so hard, so fast, that the boys cheer them on and protect them. Practice is over. In the dimming light, Daddy and the little sisters go home to Mama and their big sisters. So there's the older boys. So at first they didn't want them to play in their tennis court, but now they're getting good and they want them to. And then there they are heading home. Do your schoolwork, Venus. Do your schoolwork, Serena. I want you girls to be educated, Mommy says. The sisters listen, they study, and they concentrate. When Venus laughs, I laugh harder. When Venus cries, I cry harder, Serena says. That's just how close those sisters are. So there they are, they're laughing together, they're crying together, and they're studying together. It's nice to have a sibling that's so close to you. Word gets around about those Williams sisters can hit how hard they can hit the tennis ball. Offers to give the sisters a new tennis ball 
and new rackets and new tennis clothes and chances to play tennis matches arrive at the house in Compton. Mama braids Venus's hair for her first tournament. So there they are. They're getting ready for their tournament. They have new rackets and new balls that people donated to them. That's nice. And then there she is getting her hair ready for her first competition. When Venus walks out onto the perfect green court, she sees a sea of white faces. Concentrate, she tells herself. The crowd fades away like the gunfire in Compton. She hits the ball hard. There she is. And her first tennis match. Thonk! Thack! Venus wins. Then the sisters play their first tournament. White beads gleaming. Venus cheers from the stands. There she is. She won her first tournament. That's awesome. And then there they are watching from the stands. Concentrate, Serena tells herself, and the crowd fades away. She hits the ball hard, back and forth. Thonk, thwack, thonk, thwack. Serena wins. There she is. She's winning again. The trophy collection begins. The word gets around. A tennis academy invites the sisters and their family to Florida. Venus and Serena practice under palm trees and go to school. And practice and go to school. Until Mama and Daddy see they're old enough to play in big tournaments. There they are in Florida. Look at those big palm trees. Have you ever seen palm trees before? I bet some of you have in Florida. Thwonk. No longer little sisters, Vina and Serena are tall and strong. Thack. And they play strong. There they are. Pluck. Plonk. They keep on playing. Trophies pile up, one after another. Trophies make some people green with envy, but the sisters concentrate. Not hearing the boos, they keep winning. They are powerful. Look at all those trophies. And there they are, they're growing up. They're not little girls anymore. The sisters try new ways of dressing, new hairstyles. No one has seen in tennis before. Venus starts a business and designs tennis clothes and still plays tennis. There they are. Look at that hair. Pink hair. Do you want pink hair? Would you like pink hair? And then there's her clothing that she's making. Serena acts on TV and still plays tennis. But anyone can get sick. There they are playing tennis and they're in front of a camera, it looks like. Venus gets a disease that makes her weak, too weak to play tennis. She fights to recover and play again. Serena gets a blood clot in her lungs. She fights to recover and play again. There she is. She's fighting. She's in the hospital there. She's trying to play tennis there. I hope she gets better. The sisters train hard and practice hard and hit those bright balls on their own in the tennis court, concentrating like they did when they were little. And they continue to play and win trophy after another. There they are. They're practicing hard to get their strength back up. And when the sisters play each other, 
before thousands of people, that cocoon of concentration wraps around each of them. It's like they're alone on the court, just like they were at the raggedy court in Compton. Spirits soaring high together. There they are, they're playing each other in tennis. And look at all those people to see them. That's cool. Sisters. Then there they are together. I hope you like this book. Let me know about how you and your sibling play with each other. Do you play games? Do you go outside and play? Do you play tennis or basketball? Let me know. If you don't have a sibling, maybe you have a cousin or a best friend that's like a sibling. Let me know and post a picture of you with them or a video with them. That'd be really cool. I'd love to see that. Have a great night, guys. Bye.